you, you know, uh, black people have suffered, you know, because I'm also black, you know, we suffered in school and everything. But recently we had a show in Southern Sudan. We went there, you know, it was all fun. People saw me, they were, you know, welcoming me. Oh my goodness, welcome, you have cast. Others thought I was in Zungu, you know? They welcomed me when they saw Omara. Everyone was like, hey, our brother has come back home. Eh? I was like, no, that is just Omara, that is just Omara, you know, he's great. But I should say, black kids, we suffered in school. I remember they used to call me names like Bleaching Resistant. I know, you know, Dark Knight and all those things, you know. Even when you're at school, brown kids always have all the, all the, all the privileges there. A, a brown kid will, have, will become head prefect, you know? A brown kid will become library prefect and everything like that. Some fancy, fancy posts. A black kid like me, mess prefect. <laughs> Toilet and compound prefect. <laughs> no, I, was like, I was like, what is this? How are we supposed to feel, you know? Yeah, it was very crazy. I remember one time, you know, even when they are doing commercials in school. You know, there are those commercials, eh? They want to show you, oh my goodness, we have kids here, we feed them well. Vitivity, they they bite every day. They could not use us. I think it was the same as using second in the advert of Samona. It could not work. <laughs> huh? So, like, you know, they never used to put us there. You know, even when visitors come, you remember those things in school when a visitor comes, you know, then their visitors' parents are there, you are singing, you are welcome, dear visitors, you are welcome. Eh? For us, we never used to be like in front, the headmaster would kick you. Eh? For us, like, we would be at the back just adding backing vocal, welcome, welcome, welcome. Eh? I was like, you know, it was painful. But then one day I got amazed, you know, the headmaster came to class. The headmaster came and was like, push! You know, he caught the top three darkest kids in class. He caught us for, for, for an advert. Push! Odongo! Omara Daniel! Okay, Omara Daniel used to be like the SI unit of darkness, so they couldn't leave him. <laughs> eh? So like, they called him, Omara da Daniel, come, you guys are going to do a commercial. We're like, are you sure? Eh? This time around, the dark kids are doing a commercial. You know? We're like so excited. It, it is our first commercial, you know, where they are swagging, swagging, yeah? So we asked the headmaster, headmaster, what are we supposed to do in the commercial? He told us just be there. Yeah? <laughs> so we're there, the black of us, you know, having our black swag and we are swagging around. Out of nowhere, lights, camera, action, they were shooting and I saw M. Zungu walk into our clip. The African child exposed to malaria, diarrhea, and nodding disease. Donate to South Africa. So I was like, hey, you guys. Eh? It's looking dark, like, you know, when you're dark, do you look as though you're dying? You know, they used us for that. Yeah. We made a commercial for collecting money for Africa, you know, it was not funny. You know? But then, you know, it used to be of advantage, you know, those days when you are studying in school. You know, in the village, the government would give us, like, yellow shoes, but they never used to accept them in school, you know. So when you come at the line there, the teacher on duty is like, Bush, Odongo, Omar Daniel, please, go back home and put on black shoes. No yellow shoes in school. What we would do is we just go behind, remove the yellow shoes, we come in line. I was like, aha, very good shoes. But tomorrow brush them, brush those shoes, enter. But you know, being black was working and it was all nice, you know.